On a chilly Saturday afternoon, dozens make their way to the home on Hanson Road where 11 year old Ria Rush Kumar was found murdered Thursday evening. Flowers, balloons, and stuffed animals lay in two separate piles. Gifts for the young girl brought by community members, some alone, some with family. As a mother um, and as a wife, I think uh, it, it hits really hard. Especially for someone that's close to my age, it's scary. Ria's body was found in the basement of her father's home late Thursday evening, shortly after an Amber Alert had been sent out on cell phones, TV screens and radios across the province. The girl's father, Rupesh Rajkumar, was arrested around midnight in Oral Medante, about an hour and a half north of the Brampton home. He's currently in a Toronto trauma centre being treated for an undisclosed injury. This afternoon, investigators remained on scene combing through the home for evidence and clues as to what happened. We are we are broken as a community. We we this is my area. I I've been on this street for about 20 years. Um, it's sad. It's one of our own. We've lost one of our own. Ria has been described by those who knew her as someone with a vibrant personality. These videos showing an energetic young girl taking part in a local dance class about a year ago. It's incredibly shocking. We've been bringing the community together. There's been an outpour of support, um, especially from parents. You know, as a mom myself, um, I can't even imagine what it would be like for Ria's mother right now. I wish she was here. I wish I could hug her and tell her that I'm with her. Uh, but I think as a mother, I resonate the feelings of every single mother on the planet. We're all with her. Rupesh Rajkumar's next court date is scheduled for this coming Tuesday, the same day the city of Brampton will be holding a public vigil for young Ria. In Brampton, Erica Natividad, City News.